Hello, YouTube! Today, we're gonna... Well, my name's Blinkshot, of course. I always start with that, even though I don't like to start with that. I always do. Today, we're gonna be going over, um, how I made this trap. Now, it's a fairly common trap. A lot of people do know how to make it, because it's probably one of the most effective traps out there. Now, let's see if I have any ladders. No, I do not. That's gonna be a problem. Alright. Um, so... If you see here, you know, this is full of water. Actually, let me go inside. I have two ways to get inside. I have this way, and then a staircase come from my main room. I go down here. Alright, now I'm going to sort of explain this. I'm going to go in the main uh, water pit. You know, this might seem a little bit intimidating, but um, you're going to want to dig down. Okay, first, you're going to want to find your middle spot where you're going to want to where you're gonna want this piece to be where you're gonna pick up all of your items then you're gonna dig out one two three four five six seven eight squares now once you dig out eight squares um... dig down one two three four five squares so dig down five squares uh, that'll take you a little bit of time. Um, so once you do that, you're going to want to layer... with lag. You're going to want to keep the bottom open. Like, dig out the bottom part and keep it open. And then uh, get two layers of glass right here. You see that? Now once you have that two layers of glass on there, you're going to want to dig out your main part completely. Just dig this all out. This is going to be like a top thing. It's going to have like a little thingy going back and forth from here. Oh, make sure you do the eight squares on each side, too. Forgot to add that in. I'd like to be descriptive, but uh, you probably won't be able to get this. I'm a really bad explainer unless I make it while I do it. And I was thinking about filming it, but uh, I didn't. So once you lay down those two glass squares, you're going to destroy everything that's in here. Remember that these walls won't be up, so you'll be able to jump back and forth between that thing and everything. And uh, the original ground level is actually where this sand, is actually where the cacti is right now. So, um, yeah. Uh, you're, once that's done, you're going to find a little way inside your place. No, no, you're gonna make this wall that I have right here around the edge. Right here. Um, and then you're gonna start, you know, this, this is optional between which step you want to do. Either make the wall, or you're gonna want to make sure you put a bucket of water right on this piece of glass. Right on the pieces of glass, the top layer. Don't put it on the stone above it. Some people make that mistake. Uh, that's not how you do it. Um, once you have that filled up, you know, do the wall thing that I just told you. Then, uh, put this, uh, put down, like, the flooring everywhere except for that one square where you, uh, have your loot and everything that you're gonna get. Remember that where this sand is, is the original, um, the original, this is where it's originally gonna be. So, you're going to dig that down, and then, instead of layering right here, instead of layering like that, you got to layer in this bottom layer right here, and layer it like that, right one layer on the stone right above the glass. Um, now, once you have that done, uh, quick and easy step, just put a couple of stone down cobblestone and then put us uh, ladders going up you know you can customize whatever you want I put a piece of wool because it's sort of like the center you know it's nice and white so then now you get sand and you put every odd number whatever you know you can sort of get the general idea and then you put cacti on it now once you have all your cacti down oh wait wait wait, 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 wait. step back a, just just step back a second instead of place before you place down all your sand and cacti, make sure you make this top layer part. You're going to want to, let's just say this is your wall right here. You're going to want to pop up 
and then pop another one up and start making the top layer like it is right there. So now once you have all of that done, you're going to want to layer out the sand and then the cacti. Um, now some of you may be wondering why the hell is the glass in like this and it's not in between the cacti. If you put anything in between two cacti, it will destroy itself. It'll like turn back into like the small little tablets that you pick up. So what you're going to want to do is in between each, you're going to want to put a stone down and then a glass. And then once that's done, you know, you're pretty much done. You just, you know, customize, get a chest in here. Um, I actually, wow, I'm lagging really bad, sorry. I actually uh, dug out a little thing up there, f um, make an entrance in, whether it's going to be through the bottom where your hole is right here, or whether it's going to be in the top like I did it. You know, you can do either or. And that's pretty much how I think I got how to do it. Um, uh, if you're new at making the cave, remember you're going to want an 80 by 80 cave. Where If you're standing here AFK, you're going to want the maximum number of the maximum range that monsters can spawn from you is 80. So you're going to want to have 80 blocks away from that point. So, uh, yeah. That's it, guys. Um, I'm going to go break those torches and try out my thing for the first time because I have not tried it yet. So, if I didn't cover anything, please tell me. I'll put it in an annotation in the movie thing. And um, if you have any questions, I'll make another video or uh, tell you the answer. So uh, I guess I'll see you next time, guys. Later.